The toss was uh, won by Hafiz and he opted to bat first. To Hafiz. In the air and a bit of swing and immediately a thick edge that's challenging the rope and gets there. Evening Robin Jackman. Outside edge, that's raced away to the third man. On two occasions, this is better though. Lovely strike, three boundaries in the first over, it's 12 for none. Got him! It's all over already! For Nazir, he's got a blob! Yeah, it does. Beautiful bowling. It's almost like facing an off spinner if the ball swings back into you as a right-hander. Talent for the future. That's a great Yorker and still gets something on it for four from the bowler. And he's going to get punished again. Oh, and very, very clever. That's a magnificent shot. Too deep on the offside. And that's in the air. This will be out. Will it be out? Yes. Oh, I don't believe it. He's such a good fielder. He ran in, got there in time. He was on the move and then grasped it. Oh, what play. Well played. That wasn't a very good ball. Too fast and too wide. That's down the ground. Beautifully hit. Lovely and straight. Run bounce four. One of the best ones when you talk about 2020. Over the top this time. The field is coming under. Is he going to get it? No. That's gone all the way. That might not clear him. Long long. It's gone very high. And he's also thinking, oh, have I got enough? Have I got enough? Yes. And the 50 partnership comes up as well. As uh, coach Wako, are you would you be happy with that? Halfway stage, 60. That's a poor delivery. There's another one into the gap. May not go for four, but definitely will fetch three. Yes, Imran Nazir uh, has been given uh, a go up the order is just because that he comes into the team as a specialist opener, just for 2020. Two overs and then everything stops. That beautiful. That might be out. No, it's clear. Oh, what a catch! Unbelievable catch! Daniel Christian, take a bow. Well, it was going uh, away from the fielder. Sitting here in the commentary was right underneath us, and this seemed like it's not going to get to him. What? Wow! <laughs> yes. That's put down. Dear oh dear, that's two. But Hussey and now Watson have dropped catches. Then it's gone off the back of the bat, isn't it? Looked like it. His bat just twisted. Smeared down the long arm, this time it is taken. Before we have a look at the wicket. I'm not sure, but I think it was a slow delivery. And uh, Warner there at mid-off in the boundary. Yes, it was a little slower than what his normal pace is. He's just rolled his uh, wrist and uh, his easy pickings there. Yes, you can do it now. That's a beautiful stroke. That's uh, the place where the, the Zakmal brothers love it. Anything short, just outside the off stump, and he'll dispatch it. I promise you, if you bought him ten times there, he'll hit you nine boundaries out of that. Oh. And just a reminder to all our viewers in Pakistan, they can watch all the action from the World 2020. Lovely, lovely little death touch. It's not all about brute strength. And smashing it. This one went fine. It was beautifully played. It was a full toss at the end of the day, and it was all about uh, placement, really. And of course, using uh, the speed of the ball there. Oh, he's hit that one hard and into the gap for four. This is right out of the middle of the bat. It's a full toss, a rank full toss, and uh, well, they've all got to be placed, and he did it. Hold on to it when so many of those tend to pop out as you land. Coming back for two now. Hold on to it. Yeah. High full toss. 
and disappears. Looking to square leg whether it was a height for the no ball. Around about a little start with no one back at mid wicket. Certainly a big gap there. He's already conceded one four in that area. And he starts outside leg stump and he's got away with it. Has almost got a wicket. Lobbed into no man's land off a top edge. Smoke through cover. And there's nothing Mike Hussey can do on the fence. Even if it's even got uh, Dev Watko out of his seat. Full toss again. They're bowling a lot of full tosses. And uh, the placement by these two is uh, absolutely superb. And giving it some more and it's almost six. Now we're going to go upstairs I reckon. There's another big dive. Now they're going to go upstairs because this would be an incredible save if it has been achieved. No need to go upstairs. I reckon he got it uh, back while he was in the air. It's Stan Christian again. I mean, this is unbelievable. Watch this dive. He takes off, palms it back in. That's fine. Came down pretty heavily. There we go. Look at him take off. Oh, that's unbelievable. Oh, boy, he's a real athlete. 135 for three. Trying to watch the cricket. And this is over cover for four more. It's a chance for Uma Akmal, a youngster, to get into double figures. His first boundary. Yeah, this is um, this is very good cricket. I mean, these two really are uh, giving it each here. 45 of 28 balls. Not to ask for much more than that. Just look at this. Whack over the top. It's inside out to outside in. Uma Akmal has got a bit of bottom hand in this. And gone. Couldn't get it all the way. And he's picked out Cameron White. Yeah, he's having a tremendous night. Uh, is uh, Dan Christian, 143 for four. Slower ball. And sliced away with third man up inside the circle. It's going to be four more. Akmal into the 40s. Yeah. <laughs> Both of them up and it just knocked over their heads. Just watch this. He was trying to get it away on the offside, so uh, don't let it detract in any way from Kamran Akmal. Just a quick look at the wicket. Uh, right out of the middle of the bat, he picked the fieldsman in the deep. And uh, in it goes. It uh, was going like a rocket. So almost a change in the field, but they think better of it. And a Q ender from Wasak produces a single. So they get to the 150. They get to 151 from their 20 overs to Pakistan. Yeah, good performance by them, and particularly good performance by Kamran Akbar. 43 of 26, six fours in his lock. Oh, a little bit of shape into the left hander. Warner is down the track, flicks it for four. It's gone all the way, I think it's hit the rope. Warner, straight out of the blocks early. And uh, he's banked on the first one, been quite full. Could it... Well, this is nice. It's really nice. He sat back and waited, and the new ball is racing to the fence, and it's four. That's another great strike. Beautifully done through the offside. Warner has played three lovely shots. Looking forward to this one. Where does Warner go against Sahail? He goes big, he goes straight, and he goes for six. Oh, you got to love this. There's the change-up. He sat back and waited. And it's a wonderful piece of batting because he didn't launch himself. He kept still. Wonderful platform to strike from to Umar Bull. Edge and runs, four of them. Just the kind of start that will put Umar Gul under pressure. Well, that shot and gone. Shane Watson puts it away. He'll pick up runs. Slide from uh, Umar Akmo. That shot now is very good with that uh, length. Shane Watson plants it away from the fielder. Why wasn't he selected in the ICC team? That's the big question. Oh, ball and beautifully done. Saeed Ajmal has done it again. Saad Ajmal does the trick. Borden 
to uh, all well get rid of his bunny. Oh, that's well played. That's well played. He's got it into the gap. He needed that. The Australians needed that. And he's got smashed again. That's a magnificent hit way up into the uh, boxes up there. Oh boy! Yeah, you have to. It, it, it was a, you know, it was a range of emotions because we we, we were so hyped after that one day win, which I thought was a fantastic one day series win. Uh, in the area, who've come out to watch their team play, down the ground, beautifully struck. Oh, it's beautifully struck for six. He actually fetched for it. It wasn't really a half volley. He reached for it and hit it very cleanly at the end. He's good at bowling walkers too, he's going to try and do that. It's down the ground, this is going to be caught, it's going to be six, it's six, it's whoa, it's over the top. Different approach from the Australians, they measured the ground well after the first 2020. We have seen couple going over the rope very closely, this one, another one. Umar Akmal tried his best, but that was well measured by Shane Watson. Right from the middle once again, another six. Well, he's cut that away. This is going like a rocket as well. It's going to be cut off. Yes, it is. What field it is that down there? Oh, well played. Well played. Will this go for four or will he cut it off? Yes, it's gone for four. Good timing again. Ah! Oh, that's uh, adjacent, is it? And given by the umpire, it's looked out. Most wickets in T20 internationals. Not uh, many things wrong with that decision. It looked out. Goes for the sweep shot and he'll get runs. Australians are trying hard to uh, play that shot against the spinners. There's a shot fine in place. Without attempted scoop. Chance of a run out and it's a direct hit and he's gone. Umar Rathmore with the point up. Pakistan fielders got in really close in these last couple of overs. And they are celebrating and invariably they know. Invariably they know and they do. Out of the call and uh, well, the crowd's absolutely loving every bit of it. It's a big hit, that's gone, that's six, magnificent strike. Absolutely perfect, he's found the middle of the bat here. He knew that had gone for six as we did, as it soared up into the night sky. Nice and tight. That's a reverse, and well, that's gone through the legs. Now, that is bad fielding. This was uh, that uh, reverse flick that found the fence, went through the legs of Saeed Ajman. Yeah, poor bit of fielding this. He's middled it, but uh, got to it comfortably. Short one, and a miss hit. And Dan Berger! Here goes Mr. Cricket. And there you got caught in double-minded and uh, the bat sort of slipped in his hand and he was hoping that it will not carry to Shweb Malik who's at Medan, that comfortable catch there by Shweb Malik. No problem at all. Sure, one of here goes, the birthday boy and the skipper has done the trick this time. Bowling, number five, and it's David Hussey who has had his off stump disturbed. Wonderful bowling. Yeah, created a beautiful angle, slow delivery, rolled his fingers over the seam and uh, that ball just cut a little bit off the surface and hit the off stump. Had to go big. He's got enough of it, what a way to finish. He's bowling from a different end. Last ball previous over, Captain came to the party. Inside edge and there he goes. Bailey, that is, with another boundary. The Aussies lost on all three of those occasions. Can George change it? And he's looking like he can. There's the Yorker. I don't know why Umar Gould's appealing, because he squirted this and has a run out. Goal! A direct hit! They're hitting everything at the moment, the Pakistanis. And Wade has been run out. Has he got the golden touch to finish it off with the bat? It's a great attempt at Yorker. And Wade wanted to come back for two. Direct hit. Well, he's not even in the frame. Bailey gets a short, slow bouncer. Is it out? 
Yes, it is! The crowd have erupted here in Dubai and got crazy. Slow bouncer, couldn't control the shot. And there you go. Crowd in their feet and nicely taken by Yasser Arafat. Yes! That's the wicket they needed. Ah, wonderful scenes. Big! Oh, disappearing! This one has gone over the fence to silence this huge crowd. Oh my God, I don't really think any of the person in the crowd expected this. Look at that hit, that's mega. That's worth a million dollar. They can't believe it. A very small crowd, the Australian crowd, on their feet. Now what? Here we go. Last ball. Straight up in the air. Who's calling for it? Jay, there we go. He couldn't finish it, Cummins. We're going to have a super over. Oh, it's been scripted brilliantly. Super over now. What a game of cricket. It wasn't the best of the deliveries. Uh, Abdul Razak got it lucky there that uh, got the top edge. And uh, Imran Nazir made no mistake, quite comfortable. And uh, we got into a super over. What a game of cricket. It has gone right down to this, a super over. Fantastic scenes. There's the Yorker. And whips it away. We get a couple. Big boundary and big wide open spaces. Beautifully bowled by Gould. Leg bars. As he runs or leg bars? Got a little bit of bat. Yeah, quick feet. Little flick off the bat and uh, boundary for uh, Warner. This was just outside the off stump in any case. He just uh, read it quite quite nicely, Warner. Down the leg side. There's the first wide of the night. Can he make this count, Warner? No, he's hit it straight up in the air. Here's long off. Gone. Uma Akmal, after a little bit of bite play earlier in the over, gets his man. In the gap. Is it four? No, it's only going to be a couple. Back up, back up. So, 11 score for the loss of one wicket in Australia's super over. A dozen to win. Here we go. First ball of the Pakistan super over. Slow one. Beautifully bowled. Change of pace. The run out. <laughs> it is all happening. Straight down the ground. Cracking stroke for four. That relieves a lot of pressure for Pakistan. Lovely clean strike from uh, Uma Akma. He was looking for another uh, big shot. Wrong length, wrong line for Umar Akmal, and he made a full use of it, didn't he? Look at that, right from the middle of the bat. There's no fielder there behind the umpire. Shows the right place to hit. So he's gone with that shorter one. And the run out is on. Can he get it? No, he can't. Too much to go full. And he's gone short, he's got pain. And it's another boundary, and they're uh, running away with the super over. Three to win off just a couple legs. That's nicely struck by the Rosario. They didn't bat in the last uh, couple of games, but uh, was up against it. Short, wide, and dispatched it for four. They can feel it. The game is in Pakistan's pocket. Up in the air, safe on the half volley. A single will be another tie. Incredible, tied the super over. On the half volley, couldn't get there. Dave Hussey. Now, of the previous five tied games, three were decided by the old fashioned bowl out. Can Cummins do it? Oh, he's bowled around. 
The young fella's had a shocker. You get that? Press is told. And run out is on. It doesn't matter. Buckman will keep running through. They've won it. They've won the series. Have the men in green. Disconsolate are the Aussies. On the other side of the coin, they're out of their seats and the home crowd are cheering, whistling and loving it. Came down to a super over and Pakistan have held their nerve.